everybody, welcome back. Unboxing time. Sadly, no Mary. Box drought, killing all that, killing the flow of everything. Thanks, Nerdblock. Um, but anyways, we're here, uh, I'm here, we're here to open up the 2017 GameStop exclusive Funko uh, Knockout Box. So, yeah, cool. Alright, uh, you can still find these in the store. You can probably still find them online. GameStop, I assume EB Games, maybe Think Geek. I'll try to put a link in the description if you're interested. This was $25, and um, we opened the, um, actually, what was it called? I just realized I can look on this thing. And the, uh, Titanfall box, I guess, <laughs> from GameStop the other day. But I thought I would pick this up, because again, I, there's a box drought, I needed to find something, and uh, I thought I would try these. Now, with a lot of these games, I'm not really into them. Doesn't mean I won't get into them, or at least, you know, try to get familiar with them. Um, I don't really know what's in here. I feel like I heard what the pop in this was, and I'm not really going to be a fan, but I could be wrong, because that other box I ended up really being a fan of everything that came in there. So uh, we're going to check it out, and we're going to see. So this is $25. It's been out a while, too, so I'm sure some of you guys already well know what's in here. If anything, this is for the few people that don't know, or the few people that just like to see different reactions to boxes, all that kind of stuff. I thought this would get me through a few days of waiting on some of these other boxes to start showing back up. I've also had some boxes like just not get shipped this time, which I gotta talk to some people about. But all right, so uh, 25 bucks, like I said, we're gonna feel around and find out. Oh, we got wrap stuff. Is that a rock candy? All right. Is that a dorb? Is there not a pop in here? I guess that's the pop. And then maybe a dorb. What is that? Is that? Oh, that's just a cardboard filler. Pop key. Actually, these are two pop keys. Okay. Oh wait, no, that's just more filler. All right, I guess it's just a, a pop. Maybe a door. I don't know what's in here. <laughs> Let's check out what the pop key chain is. Street Fighter. Okay, now this actually has a GameStop exclusive sticker on it. The others had it printed on the box and not uh, there, but yeah, this is pretty cool. Now the thing, I do like the pop key chains, but I don't have enough things to use them for, so I don't necessarily collect too many of these. So even though this is a pretty nice looking figure or character, because uh, I was never really a big Street Fighter guy. I mean, it's not that I did not like it, it's just one I never really got into playing. You know, with the vast amount of fighting games and stuff out there. So I'm not really too familiar with it, but it does look pretty cool. I'm just not terribly excited because it's not one that I'm like, oh my god, I must put that on my keys. You know, it's not like a Deadpool or a Fourth Doctor or, you know, something like that. But um, still, not bad. I like it. Akuma. All right. Vena, Vena. So is that going to be, I guess that's going to be, let's move, let's move this uh, cardboard filler out the way. And yoink. Okay. Okay, that's the pop. All right, and then that's, well, is that the pop? That's the pop. Well, what is this? I don't know. Let's find out what this is. I think this is a rock candy. It is a rock candy. Ooh, actually, this is pretty cool. Even though I can't see it yet, I just know who it is. Okay, in a pink dress. But still, that's fine. I would have liked a traditional blue, but maybe that's what makes this exclusive to GameStop. We got a rock candy of Chun-Li. I think this might all be a Street Fighter box, because I'm pretty sure the, I, I don't know. I don't know for sure, so I'm not spoiling, but I think this, the pop is a Street Fighter pop. Um, which is a little unfortunate for me, but again, at least I'm kind of vaguely familiar with some of it. And I like the Rock Candies, and that's a pretty nice one. That might actually go on my desk. Possibly. I guess you guys want to see, huh? Right? I guess? Sort of? <laughs> nah, you're just here to look at my ugly ass face. I know, I know. <laughs> But we do have the GameStop sticker, which is cool. Again, if you're an in-box person. Now, I'm out of box, so unless I'm going to send some of these things off for prizes, like I probably will the keychain. Actually, I wish I had that when we uh, watched Street Fighter on Drunken Movie Night. That would have been great in the prize pack. Is that upside down? That's upside down. Nope, now it's upside down. <laughs> Whatever, there she is. Let's linger on that back a little bit, just so you can get a better uh, idea without all the glare of what she's going to look like. So that's pretty cool. I'm actually pretty happy with that. Um, I guess this is this is hitting its $25 value when you really break it down. Alright, so I guess we just got this pop figure left. So let's get it, and it has a sticker, and oh, actually, it's not Street Fighter, okay. Ooh, but it's actually really cool. Anything else in the box? Nothing else in the box. We got a Tekken Armor King. Oh, that's a cute kitty. Now see, uh, Mary was here, she might actually like this one even more than I do, and I actually like this. I don't know anything about Tekken. I know more about Street Fighter than I know about Tekken. I barely know anything about Street Fighter. Um, but still, sometimes, like I said, sometimes just the pop looking cool is good enough for me. And this is a very cool looking pop. And it definitely has the sticker and everything. So, very nice. Alright, let me show you guys. 
try to get that glare out of there. Ugh, I really gotta... Oh, come on, lens. Don't be a jerk. There you go. That lens is so noisy. Stop it! <laughs> Stop it, lens. There you go. Okay. I think the glares are throwing it off. But you get a good idea of it here from like the art and everything too. So I like kind of the red, blue 3D eyes too. That's kind of nice. Although it's actually red and green. Why did that look red and blue to me? Because I'm blind probably. Probably just need new glasses. Oh yeah, it's definitely red and green. Uh, <laughs> well still. It's Christmas. It's his Christmas eyes. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. Is that upside down? That's upside down. I cannot. I, yeah, I need glasses. New glasses. I need, I need new glasses. Let me not screw up the focus again. There's the top of the box. One last little look at the box itself. Pretty cool, man. Um, I liked the Titanfall box better, but um, this is a really nicely designed pop, and I do like this rock candy. So, yeah, all right, uh, that's pretty good. For 25 bucks, that's not so bad. I can, I can get down with that. These are things I would certainly keep for myself, I, I think. Uh, except the, the keychain, just because I got more of those than I need, and so if it's not something I absolutely love, uh, I'm not that interested in it. But I'm not knocking it, it's still a cool one. All right, guys, well, there you go. Uh, like I said, I'll try to put a link in the description because these things are still available. You can still grab them if you want. But uh, let me know. Did you see this when it first came out? Did you get one? Were you happy with it? Were you disappointed? What was your favorite item in the box? I'm going to say the pop for this one on me, for me, um, su surprisingly. But uh, definitely comment away. Let me know your thoughts on this. I'd love to hear it, even though I'm super late on it. All right, other than that, though, click that thumbs up button. Give me the good old thumb of encouragement. I do love to be encouraged. I miss Mary. Uh, and <laughs> I guess, actually, I'll probably go see her tonight. All right, anyways, I'm going to get out of here. I'll see you guys later.